Meet Camarasaurus from the Gunma Museum of Natural History in Japan. And this specimen was described by Macintosh et al. in the famous green volume because the cover is a darkish green. And here is the tail, which was an original tail. These vertebrae were mostly articulated. And what I'm looking at here is I'm studying their sides to look for morphological characters to help me differentiate Camarasaurus from Apatosaurus because in this part of the tail, it can be tough at times. And I am also doing a first pass survey to go all the way to the end of this tail. And what is unique about this specimen, well, not unique, we have a couple now, is that it was preserved all the way to the tip of the tail, which if I can get my camera work right here, I'll point out that is an actual end of the tail. And you can see that in camera source, the neural arch is present and functional all the way back to almost the very end of the tail. We just saw some pathology and there's another pathological vertebra or two in this case. It's a beautiful tail. I love it.